Hey, it's July 6th, 2011, and it's a Wednesday, so you guys see me again. I'm Sonia. Um, today we're going to be reviewing Happy Mania, which is out of print because it is really old, and also because it is by Tokyo Pop. I'm still not over them disbanding and failing as a company. It really hurts, man. Manga community, why you no support? <clears throat> so, Tokyo Pop decided to bill Happy Mania as its answer to Bridget Jones, which uh, I have to disagree with them on a few points. Bridget Jones is 30-something. Shigeta here is 24, so she's in her 20s. She's 20-something. She's mid-20s. Also early 20s, so she's almost 20s. Everything except late 20s. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys, I'm a little sick, so I'm not as animated as I usually am. Um, I am also more... You can hear me now. Um, <clears throat> I was very lucky to come across these because they're so old and so out of date. I think this came out when I was, like, 17. Yeah, I think so. Um, it's about trying to find the right guy and finding a whole bunch of bad guys, kissing a whole bunch of frogs, to find that one good guy. I have to say I can relate. I think everyone can relate. I think every, not just every female, but every male also in this age group can relate. Um, I think this is good for everyone to read, especially during those times that you feel like, I'm never going to find the one. <clears throat> I don't feel that way now. <laughs> but, yeah. I, I do recommend that you read this. Because... You don't feel alone. Yeah, there's plenty of romantic comedies that are full of hijinks about, like, missing the right one by this much. You were this far away from each other in the Starbucks. And yeah, no. Um, this is more about the search and how many fails you made because you were being stupid. Um, it's nice to know that none of us were alone. It feels like someone was watching, like, Sometimes my life, sometimes people, people's lives that I know, that I've been friends or acquainted with, um, it just felt so real. I'm not a big fan of the art style, i got to say. Look, that kind of is odd to me. <clears throat> but I didn't let that detract from the story. The story is actually really good. Um, she's extremely delusional. She is a 24-year-old woman through and through. Um, she's a 20-something-year-old woman through and through. Please, guys, read it. It's amazing. It's not Bridget Jones. It's better. Um, except there's no Mr. Darcy. Not yet, anyway. Maybe Colin Frick will pop out of nowhere. That would be very odd. Wouldn't it? What would it be like? I don't like it. Can you tell? Alright, guys. Um, I had a previous video, but uh, my microphone wasn't pointed at me. It was pointed towards the door. So I heard more interference than anything. Can you guys hear me now? Good. <clears throat> Alright, guys. Um, I will see you next week. Hopefully, I will see a video from JoJo tomorrow. Or from Katie. Will I see a video from you? Yes? Good! And if not, then Aaron, I will see you in a few minutes. And Jim, I will see you when I see you next. I miss you.